Yes. Today, today, can't be it anymore. Can't be it anymore. And, uh, you know, I've, I've been in Los Altos Hills in Stanford University, in Los Caros, in Mountain View, hearing stories from families, from families who've been affected. There are families right here in our midst who have been affected. The very first story I heard of was of uh, Eel Waldman right here in Palo Alto. His daughter Danielle was in the concert and she was unfortunately killed. What a sad day for humanity. What a sad day for humanity. Barbaric acts from Hamas. Look at that beautiful baby right there. Does that baby deserve to be in captivity? No. No. It's time to bring them home now. 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 It's time to do it. It's the right thing to do. And I really appreciate all of you joining us here today to make it happen. It's the collective belief of humanity from every part of the world. We want to do something right. We can turn something wrong into a right with our collective actions, with our heart. And I will dip into my Dr. King spirit today. And uh, I will call for peace. I'm going to call for peace. And uh, Dr. Martin Luther King was a huge proponent of peace. And if he was here, he would try to see how we can force the minds and hearts of Hamas, who have turned very evil in a very, very horrific way. How can we turn them around? And here is what we'll do. We'll do a very simple Om chanting for world peace including peace in our own minds, in our own minds. Because when we can create peace within our own self, that can permeate the whole world as well. It can permeate into the hearts and souls of Hamas and hopefully we can turn them around from the evil people they have become. We can do that together. So it's very simple. Take a deep breath in, take a deep breath in and then just follow me by repeating Om. That's all, that's all we'll do. Finding peace within our own selves, in our own selves, and also in the souls of families who are feeling so uneasy right now, 100 days and still in captivity. Such a sad day for humanity. We had peace on October 6th. Why was it shattered on October 7th? Why? Why was it shattered on October 7th? Okay, so take a deep breath in. moment of silence for those who have passed away and uh, let's keep fighting the good fight and bring bring the hostages home bring them home now 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 thank you everybody shalom <laughs>